What's up guys, my name's Katara from ETX Gaming and today we're playing a new game called Ronin. This game is available on the PlayStation 4. I'm not sure if it's available on any other platforms, but if it is, I will put it down in the description below. This is a side-scrolling platformer, RPG, uh, turn-based style game. It's kind of interesting, so we're going to check it out. We are going to do a continue, but I'm going to play the chapters back through. The reason we're doing a continue is because of the skill points. So, real quick, I'll go over this for you. Um, you do have to earn skills in this game. Uh, skills can only be earned by completing um, all the objectives 100% uh, through one uh, playthrough. Now, you can replay the chapters over and over again, but you have to 100% each chapter to get one skill point. Alright, so... The chapters, and we're going to start... The first one, which is Chapter 1, Old Man, Corporate Complex Part 1. Okay. So first thing we have to do, we got our sword. And we have to go get some intel on this guy that we're trying to kill. Apparently... He did us wrong. These people did us wrong. There's five of them in total that we need to kill. And for each one, we have to collect data. Now, this is not a stealth game, but I will say that stealth is recommended. <laughs> so we will do our best to be stealthy as we, of course, always are on games like this. You guys remember Counter Spy. We were super stealthy in that game. So I'm going to try to do the same here in this playthrough. Alright, so we have a guy down there who's going to automatically see us. Now as you can see the thing turned red. You can see this is my jump pattern um, that I'm using on the stick. Of course, it says up in the thing, combat is turn-based. So, as you can see, that was his turn. This is my turn. We want to try to hit him. There we go. And he's dead. Alright. Unlock this door here. This guy's up here. But I'm not sure how we get to him. So, we'll go this way. And yes, definitely want to avoid triggering alarms. Which, that is triggered by going through lights, so this will probably get this guy's attention. Oh, we didn't. Good, good, good. Hang him so he's not a problem anymore. Jump down. Go up the elevator. Some nice elevator music there. This guy's going to scan for us, which we're not coming out of the elevator just yet. Alright, and he saw us, so... Alright, so as you can see, here's the issue here. So, I could kill him, but if you look up top, there's a guy already aiming at me. So obviously I don't want to kill him because we will die. So what I want to do is jump back. Now he's going to aim there. I can just fall back down. And this sometimes takes a minute. Because that's what you're trying to do here, so. And we gotta get rid of this guy. As you can see, he was trying to call for help. If they call for help, it goes into a lockdown situation. All the doors will lock. And, uh, we won't be able to access some stuff without much difficulty. I want to say we probably could have went up here. Yeah. And avoided this whole thing. Could have just killed this guy first, but... You know me, my stealthiness. Alright, so... And as you can see, it, the arrow on the right side is telling me where the other terminal is. Um, down at the bottom, I have a, um, a bar that is taking... Uh, counts my limit breaks. So in battle, like in these um, turn-based battles, Every person you kill, you'll get a little circle. If you hit a limit break, you get an extra turn. 
Um, as you can see, if you hit any one of those circles, you get extra um, actions. Okay, so there's a glass ceiling here, but we're going to be stealthy. And this was one of the reasons why I wanted to do this on my playthrough that I have, because I have that option to hang people. And you don't get that um, until you've played a little bit. Alright, so there's two guys. Obviously, I'm going to have to fall down here and it's going to alert them, so... We kill this guy first. Now all I have to do is kill that guy. There we go. Done. And then we'll pack this terminal. And that's it. Need to get up here to this thing. Get up there, babe. Okay. And jump down and let's get on our bike and get out. Yes, and mission accomplished. All right. So, first one is done. We're going to do move on to the second one. <laughs> so, we're still collecting intel. We're trying to find this guy. This is kind of still the tutorial phase also cuz it's still telling us what to do. So we have a grappling hook. It wants me to break the glass. I think that's the only way to get in this building. So we'll do that. Come down here. Bang that guy. Um, I think we have to go down this way. I can open that, but there's kind of no point. There you go. Um, yeah, we'll go ahead and break through it. Okay. Now this is one that I have issues with because it says uh, spare civilians. I've yet to figure out how to do that on this this section. Because as soon as I get down into the light, that guy's going to see me. Um, I wonder if there's a way to get him to walk through. Let me check. I don't think there is. I don't think there's a computer terminal around here anywhere. But let me, let's check. If there is, we can unlock the door. I don't see it. Oh, there it is down there. Okay. So if I do this, I might be able to unlock the doors. Maybe these. Maybe we can kill these guys in time. Let's do, um, let's do L1 <laughs> and murder him. Okay, I don't think that alerted anybody except for those three guys. Let's unlock this. Alright, so all the doors should be unlocked now. Which is a good thing. So I might be able to get through without messing with that civilian. So let me grab that intel. that one just yet. Let's come up this way. I don't know if he'll go through the door or not. I kind of want him to. It doesn't look like he wants to. I opened it! Go through it! What are you doing? Alright. I don't have time to deal with this guy. He's gonna see us. Guarantee it. 
and then we're gonna have to kill him. Oh, maybe not. Okay. That was extremely weird that he didn't see us just now. I'll take it. Right, let's go down. Yeah. Alright, now we gotta deal with this. Okay, so this is an elevator. This is a door. Alright, um... I can probably break, uh, break the glass here and it not be noticeable. I'm gonna try to jump up. There we go. Let's hang this guy before he calls for help. Alright. Okay. There's another one, and we got one more. Um, I think we have to go to the elevator to do this. I think I can grab all of these guys fairly quickly. Uh, let's. It really doesn't matter who we stun, I guess. <laughs> oh. Fall down. Let's go over this way, I guess. left. And murder him. And murder him. There we go. Nice. Alright. Let's hack this terminal here. Alright. Now we just gotta get to our motorcycle. skill point. Awesome. So let's spin that. Um, let me see. What does this do? Teleport to a decoy. I kind of want to do this one. Because we can make decoys. Let's select this node and put the skill point here. And then this one will let us be able to use decoys without having to go grab the projector. So we throw down a projector and it makes a decoy. And they'll shoot at the decoy. Um, kind of allows you some time to get away or to plan your next move. So, alright. Um, well, I think we have enough intel. So let's go get this guy. A couple civilians here. And there's the old guy right there. Kind of want to survey my options here to see what I got going on. There's that samurai guy, which he sucks. Alright, so. I guess we're gonna have to break through glass. We can open this door, but I have a feeling it's gonna just alert people if we do it. So let's break some glass here. Well, he didn't do it that time. Come on, dude. Oh, well. Yep. 
Can I get in the door without having an issue? It won't let me. There we go. Stab him. Let's be quick about this. Um, who do I want to go? I'm going up here. terribly bad. Okay, so this guy's walking around. So we're gonna go up this stairwell. But I'm gonna wait till he goes out of the room first. Okay. And what I wanna do is go up and up. And we're gonna hang him. Okay. That way it doesn't alert these guys. Here. Not quite sure why this room is here because there's nothing in here. It's kind of odd that they put that in here. All right. So this is this is part that's going to be a little bit difficult. This samurai guy sucks. Okay. There we go. He immediately goes for me again. So I'm gonna have to jump up. Oh my gosh, it's gonna be close. Let's kill him. One hit. And we're gonna have to hit him again to make this work. Go ahead and get rid of that guy real quick. Um, let's go ahead and kill this guy real quick. Okay. So now I just gotta worry about this samurai guy. Um, the trick with him is... You can't get too close. If you're too close, he will... He'll just murder you. Just straight out, just murder you. Um, so it's gonna take me a couple steps. I have to be able to get close enough to him, but not actually... get to him, I guess? <laughs> Ah! Yep. <laughs> I didn't. I didn't do that one right. Luckily, it checkpointed us. Okay, let's try this again. That was nice. Again. Oh, it won't let me. Darn it. There we go. And I missed that. Okay, so now we gotta get out of this guy's way. Because he's going to kill me. I can't. There we go. And murder him. Alright. Nice. Okay. Unlock this door. And let's just kill him. Basically, the guy knew he was gonna die. He stood up and was ready for it. Now let's just get out of here. Hopefully there's not too many people hanging around. Oh, there's so many people that just showed up. Alright. Oh gosh. Uh. Oh man, I'm gonna die no matter what I do here. This is gonna suck. Alright, well, can't avoid it. Yep. <laughs> I saw that one coming. Alright. Get 
don't know. Oh, yep, I can. Okay. Uh, who do I want to hit? This guy down. Oh, I don't know who I want to go for. Let's go for this guy. Kill him. Somebody's calling for help. Um, I don't know where this help is coming from. Knock that guy down on the ground. That'll buy us some time. Stop that. All right, I don't know how I'm going to get these guys. <laughs> gonna grab me. Oh, maybe not. That kind of surprised me because I thought he was going to. Oh, these guys suck. Uh, I think I'm dead. Yep. <laughs> God, I hate these guys. Um, I think this is a death waiting to happen too. Kill this guy and try to hit this guy. There we go. And this guy as well. There we go. So now I get an extra turn. Kill him. And there we go. There we go. Let's get on our bike and get out of here. Alright. And that was chapter one. So we are finished with that chapter anyway, and we're going to end the video here. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this episode, you know what to do. Please leave a like, share, comment, favorite, or subscribe to my channel to keep up to date with more videos just like this. Again, thank you guys so much for watching. My name is Kataro, this is ETX Gaming, and I will see you guys soon. Bye-bye.